Greetings, and welcome to another episode of Everything English. Today we're taking a look at another interesting English idiomatic expression. A ballpark figure. Before we take a look at the origins of this idiomatic expression, let's go through an example or two and clarify its meaning. Imagine you're planning a birthday party, and you're discussing the budget with a friend. You might say, I think the total cost will be around $500, but that's just a ballpark figure. In this case, you're indicating that it's a rough estimate, and the actual cost could be slightly higher or lower. Here's another scenario. You're at a business meeting, and a colleague asks about the projected sales for the upcoming quarter. You respond, we're expecting a ballpark figure of $2 million in revenue. This means it's not an exact figure but a rough estimate of what you anticipate. We often hear this expression when discussing numbers and estimates, but what's the story behind it? Like many idioms, a ballpark figure has its roots in an interesting history. The idiom's origin can be traced back to the world of baseball. The term, ballpark figure, comes from the practice of estimating the number of attendees at a baseball game. In the early days of baseball, ticket sellers would provide approximate figures for the number of fans expected to attend a game. These estimates were important for logistical reasons, such as preparing concessions and providing security. Over time, this practice evolved into a common idiom used to describe rough estimates or approximations. So, the next time you hear or use the phrase, a ballpark figure, you'll know that it has its origins in the world of baseball and signifies a rough estimate rather than a precise number. And that's it for today. If you found this video insightful, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe for more insights into the English language. Share your favorite idioms in the comments, and I'll see you in the next episode of Everything English.